Hello everyone, this is Rachel or Clad Deal Tan, and today I have an unbagging to do with you guys. I received a present from a friend, and it's doll related, and they wanted me to open it on camera so they could see my reaction. First off, I'm just going to take out this tissue paper here. It's all nice and sparkly. I want to set that aside and save it. So first thing I'm seeing at the top of the bag is a purple, oh my gosh. So this is a purple doll dress. Um, I actually recognize it. I think this is the one that um, a couple years back, uh, Mattel came out with a like, what what's it called? Like, I don't know how to pronounce it in Spanish, but Sweet 15. And this is the dress that was on that doll. But I'm thinking that it would look awesome on a Rapunzel doll. I'm gonna grab a Rapunzel doll and try that on right now because I'm too excited to wait. This here, for anyone who's wondering, is a classic Disney Store Rapunzel from, I think, 2017 or 18 on a made to move purple top Barbie body. Oh, good. I was a tiny bit worried that it would be a little too narrow because the like fancy Barbies like that this dress came on sometimes have a thinner waist, but it does fit her and it looks so tailored. It looks like she's gonna go to a movie premiere or something. This is really, really beautiful. It looks great on her. Thank you. Right. Hmm. Oh, okay. I was confused there for a second because I thought these were sleeves, but this is actually a formal dress and it's got like two layers to it basically. There's a gold underskirt and then there's this velvet uh, bodice and connected to the bodice is a little overskirt. So it's kind of like there are two skirts. Uh, it kind of looks like it might have been maybe, I was thinking for a second that it might have been a Barbie holiday dress, but it's looking handmade actually. It's very well put together. I think Belle would look good in this dress, so I'm going to grab my Belle doll. Now she is a curvy made to move, so there's a chance this might not fit her, in which case we will just try it on a different princess. I think this color scheme would really suit her, so we're going to try it first. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty! The floral pattern and the gold really looks great on her. I really like this dress, thank you. And it's the perfect length for her too. Wow, that is, that is very, very pretty, thank you. Might be fun to do some like... Uh, pretend red carpet photos sometime or something with them. I wonder what this is. Oh, it's a tiny little doll. I think it's a magnet. It's like made out of a broom. A tiny little broom and it's also a doll. That is a really, really interesting idea. I've never seen anything like this. It's cool. I don't have a lot of magnets right now, so that's going to be very handy. And there's one more thing in the bottom of the bag. Wow. Wow. This is incredible. This is a, li a little bathroom, looks like, with a toilet paper roll, a sink, and a bathtub. I've never seen a dollhouse bathroom look like this. And something that is really, really incredible is this is not 1 12th scale. This is a 1 16th or 3 quarter inch scale, depending on what you call it. And I'm putting together a 1 16th scale dollhouse right now. I And I wanted to have two bathrooms in it and I only had one bathroom set. So this is gonna be perfect. I'll do a bathroom based off of this. 
So this is, this could not have come at a better time. To the person who gave me all of this stuff, you know who you are, and I'm sure you're going to watch this video. So thank you so much for this really, really fun present. I had a blast looking at everything. And it was so thoughtful of you to put this together for me. To those of you watching this who did not give me this present, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video and you like watching, I do thrift store hauls, I do unboxings, I do videos about miniatures, I do videos about Rapunzel dolls, and I have a Disney princess collection, which these are from. I have videos for all of that. And also ball jointed dolls, which a ball jointed doll is going to live in this dollhouse. So if you're interested in any of that, please like and subscribe. You can hear about each of my new videos by joining the Facebook group linked below. If you're 13 years of age or older, I just post there every single time I put a video up on YouTube because the YouTube notification system will not let you know about every video I post, just some of them. And if you want to support my content, you can join my Patreon, that is linked below, and that is only for adults with access to their own money. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye.